Easter 2020 was anything but normal. Last year, there was no one here for Easter Sunday. It was just us and our staff. Basilica of the National Shrine, Rector Monsignor Walter Rossi says COVID forced the church to close to visitors. But this year, as America slowly reopens, life is slowly returning to the shrine. This year, there are people. And like everything else in life, people make everything happen. And churches are dead unless there's people in them. So we're happy to have people with us today. The church can seat about 3,000 people, but masses today were capped at roughly a third of that to comply with social distancing requirements. Masks were mandatory. Custodians sanitized the church between services, and parishioners had to pre-register to secure one of the limited spots. That list filled up fast. By 9 a.m., nearly every mass was full. Those who didn't register had to be turned away. Hello, last night. For those in attendance, safety was on their minds. Um, we've been vaccinated, vaccinated so. so we feel pretty good about it right now. The Basilica has been doing a great job. We went here for a Palm Sunday and Holy Thursday. Everyone's wearing masks, very socially distanced, so we feel safe. Normal is still a long way off, but for Cynthia Acabicio, a doctor at Children's National Hospital, Celebrating Easter Mass in person feels like a step in the right direction. So we're just really happy we have the opportunity to do so this year. A glimmer of optimism after a long 12 months. And with Easter, the message is hope and new life. And we are seeing that right now, especially as the vaccines are being administered. In Northeast, Zach Merchant, WUSA 9.